more than a million people flocked to major memorial parks in Shanghai last weekend to honor the departed ahead of the Qingming Festival. They avoided the peak period for the term sweeping festival, which falls on April 4th. 那么我们有的时候四月四号，我们正有事啊，单位啊，工作有事要出去有事嘛。那么我们前几年至少了已经，我们是府葬的，为了每年来至少嘛，就在这里呢，蛮好的。我们子女啊都过来嘛，就是看看我的爸爸，对啊。Every year, about seven million citizens sweep the tombs and offer food, tea, wine, pepper paraphernalia, and flowers to the ancestors. Major highways are clogged in the direction towards the cemeteries. Funerals are usually a somber affair, but over the years, Shanghai authorities and cemetery operators are turning funerals and the festival into a celebration of sorts for the departed elderly. Like Shanghai, this area of old age is very fast, very fast. So, the elderly have average life expectancy of over 81 years. 从古来说，七人生七十古来稀，过了七十以后，丧事变成了喜事。因此，我们一方面在表达敬仰、敬仰整个环境的庄严的同时，也采取了一些能够减轻商家悲伤心理的服务手段和方式。那比如说，在冬至的过程中，入葬采用呃这个一百个。这个呃，笛手，啊，吹笛子的笛手，来为逝者送行。The festival becomes more cultural with rolling lantern performances and other folk dances. Changes have taken place in the city's funeral and interment service industry. Memorial parks are better landscaped and decorated with symbolic tombs and statues of the departed. There are memorial gardens for celebrities and famous people too. With the government pushing for non-ashes burials to save space, more citizens opt for land-saving burials now. 50% of people use the cremation method, while 30% still choose to bury bodies of the departed. 那么我们下一步是什么呢？曾经周恩来总理提提出过两次革命的理论。一次，第一次殡葬洗漱革命呢，就是从不保存遗体，那么出现了我们现在保存骨灰的情况。那么第二次殡葬洗漱革命呢，就是不保存骨灰，因此今后的殡葬改革的趋势，就是要找到一种不保存骨灰的多种形式，同时要把最值得保存的人生文化如何保存下来。The trend for sea burials. Which addresses the city's land shortage problem in the long run, grows by 10% every year. 海葬的价钱，政府有补贴的。无论是谁，你只要海葬，都有一定的补贴。这个补贴呢，达到三百多块。但主要是老百姓生活水平提高了，有钱去买墓地。再加上陆土为安的葬式是人们的传统观念。我们的调查呢，就是百分之四的公众是接受海葬的。但现在，真正采纳海葬方案的呢，还只有百分之五、百分之二左右。Even though sea burials are the cheapest option, many still opt for cremation and other less land-saving burial methods. From Shanghai, Chao Haoban, The Star, Malaysia.